Well, you paid the blackmail. How many husbands have you had? Mine or other women's? Yours. Five. Five? Yes, just the five. Husbands should be like Kleenex. Soft, strong, and disposable. You lure men to their deaths like a spider with flies. Flies are where men are most... This video is scheduled for one look, introducing to you today, the bro beauty guru and your host for Wrestling With Beauty, the ring queen, Lexa Rose! Okay, so, hold on, let me just take this out. I only have it up because I thought I was going to go wash my cat, but... Today's look is going to be from the Pure Festival uh, 2.0 palette, I guess. Yes. So, I got this in my BoxyCharm. If you haven't seen the video, please check out the link below. Um, I got my BoxyCharm for the month. Uh, it, it, if you noticed in the video, the package was destroyed. Like... Boxy charm. Really? Not even. I blame the post office for this. It looks like somebody literally tried to like. Yeah, somebody legit freaking opened this. Um. Yeah, not very you know. But anyways. I'm going to do a look with the Pure Festival 2.0 palette. It's very, very pretty. As you can tell, it's got a lovely color story. I don't know if you can see it. There we go. Um, my face is primed and ready to go. My hair is looking cute. Thanks to insert name here. This is the Shayla Pony. Um, not sponsored by them, but let me tell you, I swear by them 110% because, I mean look so we're gonna do a quick cute little look I it's Friday I felt like doing some makeup so I decided to do a cute little makeup look um it, this is a special bonus video for you guys it's Friday I figured why not let me throw a little content your way so I'm going to do myself up basically I'm gonna be doing a simple look so we're gonna get started um they're all labeled up here we're gonna start with uh, Dreamland, which is this pretty coral shade. Let's see how the fallout is. Oh. Actually, I take that back. There's a lot of fallout. But there's still pigment on the brush a little bit. So we're just going to dip right in and just kind of put this wherever. I already primed my face. I already, I did light, light concealer and foundation. I just did it on my under eyes where I have bags and around my mouth because pretty much my lips are bruised from doing the candy lips uh, treatment. I'm on day six. I haven't done the session yet. I'm going to probably wait till before bed so that at least the bruising might calm down. So we're just going to stick Dreamland right here. Oh, that's a Pretty color. Please ignore the brush. Ignore the brush. Okay, but this palette smells really good. Like, it does. And there's a lot of fallout. I don't want to, like, take too much of it off, so I'm just being real light with it. But, oh, wow. This is really pretty. I'm, I'm, I'm shocked, so, yeah. Okay, 
so I got it on um, off camera what I did was um, I just did my contour and my cheeks uh, I prepped my eyelids with the pretty vulgar eyeshadow primer yes this is it I used it because it's such a sticky base I really really like using it it's become like my favorite go-to eyeshadow primer because it really as you can tell it, it it's sticky it's a sticky base that really like picks up the color so I really wanted to use um, that I also put just a little bit of foundation under my eyes a little bit of foundation around my lip area because this is where the bruising is from the candy lips and I also did my eyebrows just a little bit, nothing too crazy. I just wanted to go with a, a little natural look today. So, of course, we're going to go into the next color, which is Photo Op, which is this brown, warm brown color. And we're just going to put that right on top of, what's it called? Dreamland. Okay, so now that we've got that on, we're going to go for something in the crease. Uh, let me find a crease brush. Oh, found it. Moda Brushes Crease Brush. It's called the BMX 430. And I'm going to go right into this darker color called Onset. And we're just going to put that a little bit in the crease and the outer corner. Okay, so I really didn't want to go too crazy. I really wanted to go with a neutral look, but Utopia and VIP Pass are really, really pretty colors, and I definitely want to see what Utopia looks like and VIP Pass, but I still want to keep it nice and simple. I'm going to just put Euphora in the inner corner. You know what? <clears throat> Hold on. I know what I'm going to do. All right, so we're going to go with Utopia, and let me get a brush. Okay, we're going with brush. That's what I call these double-ended ones. They're called brush. And we're just going to see how Utopia looks. Ooh, it's a little... Okay, Ooh, I kind of went a little too deep there. All right, let me just kind of... That loaded pretty nicely. So we're just going to... Pop that oh okay um that's pretty that's super pretty oh wow that's pretty let me give you a close-up just so that you can see what it looks like That is a really nice color, like, I'm like shook, dude, oh my god, alright, so let me, oh. oh, oh, wow, that's a really pretty color, so, um, I'm gonna do the other eye with the same color, and then we will pick, um, VIP pass and see how that looks with it. So now what we're going to put on the middle of the lid, we're just going to go with VIP Pass. I think I'm going to use Fantasy World on the lower lid with Turn It Up. These two colors. I want to try and use as many colors as I can, but, you know, you can't produce miracles. So we're going to just put VIP Pass right here and let's see how it works. <laughs> So we're going to go 
back in with on set and we're going to just put that right into the corner and blend these together. <laughs> fluffy brush and just blend everything together up here all right so now we're gonna do the under eye and we're going to take this color fantasy world which is this purple and we're gonna put it under the eye and then buff it out with turn it up which is this really nice like hot coral pink color as opposed to dreamland which is more like an RNG coral so ah found it my smudger brush we're gonna put this underneath the eye just to kind of give it another little vivid pop and then blend it out with turn it up <laughs> plan on that but they kind of do match with the greens and the purples and the browns and stuff I wasn't planning this I swear on God but since I did let's keep going so now that I got that we're gonna do the inner corners and the brow bone we're just gonna grab another small brush I will use this one this will be fine uh, this is the Moda brush BMX 420 this is the detail brush um, we're going to just go right into Euphoric, which is a really pretty light gold color, and we're just going to go right in there and pop it on the inner corners. <laughs> Okay, so I put on my contacts off camera. Uh, these are Egypt Blue from the Third Eye Company. This is my contact case where I house my contact cleaning kit, my little vial of fluid, the tweezers, the applicator, along with the contact lens case. So if you ever want to get some budget contact lenses and you don't have really problematic eyes, definitely, definitely, definitely hit them up. Their prices are so reasonable. And you could get as many as you want and in your prescription. The cosplay ones, I'm not sure are prescription, but that's neither here nor there. Um, what I'm going to do is now that I've got my contacts in, I'm going to put on the setting spray, put on the highlighter, then liner and lashes and lips for the final one. So I'm going to hit up my favorite, toujours, my iconic London setting spray, which, oh, it smells so good. And it gives me that dewy looking glow. And then we're going to top it off with our Artist Couture Diamond Glow Powder in Summer Haze. And we're going to take our Morphe brush and just pop some right there. Ooh, 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 ooh. Cold. So we're going to grab our Morphe M510, which I love. It just makes it easy to apply the highlight. <laughs> Okay, so now it's time to do the lashes. Um, of course, I got my curler. I'm using my Love Me Lashes 3D Mink Lashes. 
in number, I believe it's called 44. I got it from the Love Me Hair Company, which is another great hair company as well, uh, besides insert name here. Um, if you want to check them out, their, their information will be down in the description below. Again, I'm feeling this Shayla ponytail that I got from insert name here. It's something quick. I mean, my hair is curly naturally, so it works out. It matches my hair color. Love, love, love it. So I'm going to do liner and lashes, and then we'll finish up with the lips. falsies on what I like to do is I like to coat them with lash uh, mascara I'm using this Lily lashes mascara which is love it that was a little gross but yeah we're gonna pop these on and use it to bind it to the false lashes because as we all know folks it is the mucus that binds <laughs> Okay, so as you can tell, everything is pretty much on. So what we're going to do now is we're going to press them together. And there we go. Gives it the old razzle-dazzle. That's what I call it. Get that little press in. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Look at that. It's so pretty. <laughs> Of course, the little razzle dazzle always works. Um, these are a little bit bigger than lashes that I'm normally used to, but um, I still got them in there, and I still gave them a good old little press and lift. So now we're gonna do the lips. We are going to take um, our lip liner. We're gonna go for our Beauty Bakery in Versailles, and we're gonna line the lips first, and then apply everything else. This is the completed look. Uh, it's obviously from the Pure Festival 2.0 palette. Um, it took a little working with because of a lot of the fallout, but it's pretty blendable. Like I said, again, it takes a little bit of work to blend it, um, but depending on the type of primer you use, obviously the colors are pigmented. They're really pretty, and they're. I like the press glitters. They're really nice. They look really good on me. I didn't have to spray or anything like that. I had to kind of go a little into it or it'll probably be easier to apply with your finger, but I'm thoroughly happy with this look. Of course, I had to throw on my lashes. I love, love, love the company Love Me. Their lashes are awesome. I'm definitely going to pick up some more. I have other uh, cosmetic products coming in soon, so... Uh, don't forget to subscribe, press the bell notifications, and I will see you on my next video. I am the Rain Queen Lexa Rose. Keep it Gucci Poochie, bitches.